Hey everybody, Mary and the Barbarian here. We got another great shave for you today. Oh, got something on the shirt. We got off work. We're gonna get a shower after this. We've already washed the head and the face. And uh, we are using American Vintage, a collaboration between the Razor Company and McDuff's. This was sent to me by the Razor Company and might I say this is a magnificent scent. We will put the scent notes up. And then we're going to go ahead and put up the base ingredients. A little tired, guys. Wore out. Ready, shower, and go to bed. Y'all may not even get this video at regular time because I'm probably going to do the editing. And then while I'm waiting for it to save before I can upload it, I'll probably fall asleep. And that's just where we are today. Um, the scent, guys, really cool. Um, I think it said something about he wants it to be like rock and roll scene. It's got like tobacco and leather and I think like citrus and mahogany and red um, rosewood not redwood and this did not make as much lather as I thought it would I'll have to go back to McDuff's again and just see if this is just an issue I used a decent amount of soap you see how much is on the face so what's left in the bowl so we'll see gonna use the TRC DE safety razor because that is definitely my go-to now, I will admit this lather could probably use some more water, which would have allotted for more lather. Yeah, it's not rinsing like terribly easily. It looks well hydrated, but it's just super thick. I'll just paint in some more. Scent guys, really enjoy it. Um, it's a leather. I don't know that I'd say it's sharp. It's kind of bright. I'd say a little bit of woodsy. Ooh, blue projection. I want it to land on the counter, not the floor. That's why I'm like... Rushing to get the blue pitch on the counter. Ooh, look at that. It's just dripping. I do like the scent. I was never really big on leather scents, but they've been they've been growing on me. It's not like a dirty scent. It's, it's a new leather, in my opinion. But I think the woods is helping it out. I know the citrus is. I do kind of feel like you get an underlying tobacco smell it's not prominent it's not like top it's not forward it's not just sticking out there but as I'm catching whiffs I'm picking up on it a little which is awesome get that line straight McDuff's, I've only used one other of their soaps, and it was, lather's bothering me, I'm going to wipe it up. It was Canascus Pass, I want to say. Uh, piney, Pacific Northwest Woods type scent, in my opinion, is what it reminded me of when I smelled it. That was an older formula than this as well. I do enjoy the scent, man. There is something about leather I can enjoy. Like I said, used to not be my thing. We've pretty much used up all that lather on two passes. No three passes today, Lee. No pickups. We don't have to buff and make sure we get it all the way we want it, too. Look at that, guys. Like there's barely any lather left in the bowl. But I did just say, you know, that looks plenty creamy enough. It's not a lot of lather. But that should be doable. And honestly, it's a good lather. I mean, we've got bloopage. Y'all seen it? It is well hydrated enough. And again, I apologize. I just know I'm not going to stay awake after the editing goes to save. 
So the way it goes is, you know, if you don't know, you edit a video on the program I'm using, Kind Master. I need to look at a different one. Lather Hog recommended one recently. But you do the editing, then you gotta save the video. And sometimes it takes, you know, 20, 30 minutes to save the video. And I'll probably fall asleep during that time. And then once you save the video, you go and upload it on YouTube, then you gotta put the title in, location, you know, schedule it, put in my write-up at the bottom, which isn't a write-up, I just use like my gear used, affiliate links, um, links to the products used, and then a bunch of worthless hashtags. Oh yeah. Man, I do like leather. Just clean it up, make sure we got it good. It's good, it's good, it's good. All right guys, y'all know the drill. We're gonna rinse up, we'll be right back. Hey guys, everybody back. Man, I've got music playing, so when I stopped the video, it started playing again. And I had Every Rose Has Its Thorn playing. I like that song. I loved it in high school. Definitely came out before my high school days, but it was a big song for me in high school. Shake Well, Valley of Ashes, Southern Witchcraft. Use that lovely splash. Valley of Ashes is like a leather store and a tire store, you know, joined forces. Mmm. <sighs> That's nice. I do enjoy it. It's not a summer set, but you know, I don't even think we're getting to 80 today. So, woo! Sorry, a little bit of burp there. We did use the Kent Designs, Moon Soaps, Leaf Lads. Man, Zachary Kent, I can't remember what he said, but he pretty much hurt his hand. He's gonna have to have surgery and stuff, so he's not turning brushes for a while, but let's hope everything turns out okay. Because I like his brushes, and not only do I like his brushes, you, you don't want anybody to like have issues the rest of their life. That sucks. American Vintage, I do recommend it. Guys, they don't have the splash. I need to hit Jason up and be like, are y'all going to make more splash for this? Was this like an only one run thing? Just curious. But right now, you can get the soap. It's worth it. If you got other leather scents, like aftershaves, you can mix and match. But man, I do like this one. I was going to smell it with the lid on. I do like it. Really good. All right, guys. You know it. You made it this far. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. Comment below. Subscriptions would be loved, you know, if you have not subscribed. I need some, I would like to have some more subscribers. And um, what was it? Uh, Johan was trying to do the whole thing, and he said the – I can't remember what kind he was saying for the notification. But, you know, hit that noti bell. If you know the term hit that noti bell and you know what YouTuber that's from – we can be friends. All right, guys, see you tomorrow.